guys, welcome to another episode of What's the Word with DJ Snowflake. I'm your host, DJ Snowflake. Uh, first thing, intro. I have the music together that I want for it. Didn't get the animation done, so I decided to just leave the crappy one from last week. Uh, so, first story I want to talk about. Uh, there wasn't really like a huge story. Other than this, really, that I saw a lot of people talking about, you know, check Twitter, Datpiff, Hip Hop DX, other sites. Uh, probably the biggest story was Lil Wayne sent another letter from prison. And I'm not a Wayne fan, but, you know, something to talk about. It. So, he sent a letter. I don't know if it was in the letter or if this just Young Money Camp released this statement, but he's going to be dropping uh, an EP on, I think they said it's on his birthday, it's sometime in September, it's called I'm Not a Human Being, so Wayne fans, he was something to look forward to, plus like, he was smart about going into prison, he recorded all these videos, and he still has music on the radio, and unreleased music, so he was smart and made it seem like he never left. Like, he's out of the public eye, but he's still making money. So, he's a businessman. I'll give him that. Uh, other stuff in the letter, he one, like he broke down base, his basic day in prison. First thing that caught my eye is he wakes up at 11 a.m., I didn't know you could sleep till 11 in prison. Like, I don't know. I've never been to prison. I don't know anybody currently in prison. I didn't know you could sleep till 11 a.m. Like, don't you have to go to bed at a certain time? How are you still sleeping till 11 a.m. if you have to go to bed at, by, like, midnight? Uh, maybe it's just me. Maybe that's not even how it works. I could be wrong. But, he sleeps till 11 a.m., drinks coffee, takes a ch I don't know, basic stuff. Reads fan mail. Ah, yeah. If you want to read it, I'll leave a link to the letter. Next thing I wanted to talk about wasn't, like, a real big headline story anywhere. But, when I came across it, I got excited. Both, well, Eminem is overseas in Europe, touring. And, uh, so is Wu-Tang. Maybe all of Wu-Tang. I know Raekwon is. Basically, Raekwon bumped into Eminem. They started talking. He has a twit pick to prove it. And, uh, basically, Raekwon's talking about he wants to collab with Eminem, which I think would be awesome. Who, who else would want to see that? Raekwon and Eminem? Come on. This sounds like an awesome collaboration. Last thing I wanted to talk about, uh, this news actually came before the last video I did, but I didn't get a chance to listen to the song, so I didn't want to talk about it, obviously. Was uh, Jay-Z and Rick Ross uh, Freemason song. Uh, I saw a lot of people on Twitter, hip-hop websites, forums, whatever, all talking. First thing they say is that Rick Ross held his own against Jay-Z, which, yeah, I'd say they're about equal on the song. But another thing I saw was a lot of people were like, man, this is like reasonable doubt, Jay. No. I disagree. This is like Blueprint 3, Jay. <laughs> because it, I mean, it was a good song. Like, Jay-Z's verse is nice. And Jay-Z squashes the whole rumor about him being a Freemason, which <laughs> I never believed. If you go back and watch an old vlog... If it's a secret society, we wouldn't know about it. Just saying. So, he squashes that whole thing. And, you know, it's a good verse. Like, it, it's not like it sucked. But it wasn't Reasonable Doubt J. It was Blueprint 3 J. Yeah, so those are really all the big stories that I wanted to talk about this week. There was one more that I didn't get a chance to talk about in this video because... Yesterday's when it dropped was a uh, War Report 2, Capone and Noriega. I was going to do like a small review of that 
that will be on next week's show or I might do a short video like before next Wednesday and, and do a review of that because I got it I've listened to it but I haven't gotten a chance to like sit down and really listen to it which I want to do before I do the review so expect that on next week's episode maybe sooner don't hold your breath and if this is your first time watching what's the word with DJ Snowflake go ahead hit subscribe come back next week and every week after and I'll see you guys later peace